When you're sailing on the sea, there's a record player, there's Dr. Pepper, and there are in...
could be worse. Perhaps.
Look, isn't the sun in the sky shining like a record? When you're sailing on the sea, there's a... What Arcanists regard to be more important is the knowledge from another pathway, which is often known as Gnosis. Compared with mankind's knowledge gained from reasoning, what are the features of Gnosis? Sineto? Miss, the features of Gnosis are, one, it cannot be verified by an independent third party, and two, it is impossible to be comprehended through reasoning. Exactly. And that's also one of the reasons that the knowledge of the study of Arcanum is hard to be accepted by the academic world. The academic research is required to be open to the public and can pass the independent tests. But the unpredictability of Arcanum will lead to the arcane researches to methodological agnosticism. Thus, all the trainings and the scientific stabilizing appliances that the school provided for you is to overcome the instability of your arcane skill, in order to ensure the peace and stability of the human world. May the peace be with us! <sighs> oh, j'ai presque été assez rapide pour répondre à cette question. Comment elle a... Comment elle a pu être si rapide? Next question. After the fall of the Roman Empire, the number of Arcanists, along with the related literature, had reduced correspondingly. Who can tell us the history of that time in brief? Miss! Miss! I... I... Miss! I know this one! Sonetto. Huh? As the Roman Empire declined, some Arcanists were tempted by the irrational side of their nature and applied magia naturalis in warfare and disputes over interests, which irritated the church and other powers of religion. At that time, people in Europe widely considered Arcanum to be the paganism that collaborates with the demons, hence the trials against Arcanists. In response, Arcanists struck back fiercely. However, due to their spontaneous character and the unpredictability of their whereabouts, their communication was unsuccessful during the fight. Both sides struggled in repeated battles. In the end, mankind, jointly led by both their religious and secular leaders, prevailed. Huh? Mais c'est pas possible! C'est pas ce que m'a dit grand-père! Miss, she's wrong! I know! I know the right answer! All right. Give it a try, Matilda. For what I know, it wasn't Arcanists who started the war. The attack on Constantinople was waged by lordships in Western Europe to ransack the capital for resources and the literature of Arcanum. The nursery rhyme my grandpa sang for me tells me all about it. And long ago, Arcanists weren't called by this name. They were once gifted philosophers, diviners or doctors, until they were put on the labels of pagans, freaks and witches and isolated by their people. They were entirely forgotten. The next time people saw them, they had this new name. Arcanists. Inspiring. Do you remember its name? Uh, Grandpa never told me that. How about the melody? Could you present several lines for the class? Let me think. It was like... Uh, Oh, that's not it. Oh, that's weird. I... I can't remember it. Ha oh. <laughs> ha! Don't remember a thing, but still feel confident enough to answer the question. Shame on you, little thing. I was even umming the horn last night. It's just a... <laughs> Sit down, please, Matilda. Sonetto is correct. Matilda, you have just transferred here. It may take you some time to get used to our curriculum. A rhyme can be used in studying folklore, 
but it's still different from a formal historical intelligence. <sighs> Class, please turn to the last question of the test. After the Ottoman Empire seized control over Constantinople, Georgius Gemistos, a member of our Sharon commune, also an arcanist and philosopher of the Roman Empire, traveled to Florence. He brought one classical literature of ancient theurgy into the city, which sparked discussion and later brought about the annual humanist gathering, the Chaldea Conference, where the study of Arcanum was debated over its use for mankind development. Who knows the name of his work brought by Gemistos? Miss! Me! Me! Miss! Please! I know this word! I do know! Hmm. Verton, do you know the answer to this question? Verton? Verton, she is absent again. Miss, I know the answer! It is Caladia Oracles! No, you are not awake yet. You are still drowned in this mire of meditation. Sticky, swampy, and dark. Memory. Good try. The logic you pride yourself on continues to serve you properly. It allows you to make some good deductions here, like a biologist analyzing the cause of a humpback appearing in a swamp. But the answer will disappoint you, unfortunately. This is just a dream, an illusion they shoveled into your head. These people are very familiar with using coercive power. A group of people in gowns. Their gowns are made of white polyester and are over knee length. There are seven, namely number one to number seven. Probably only those odd number guys are here or maybe number four or six is also with them damn it i don't care what matters is that your classmate is among them no not the gentle and loyal one who always stands by your side it is the other one the one with indifferent outlines that makes her look like a refined machine Let's skip her first name and only pay attention to her glorious family name. Like what most people did. Like sherry cask whiskeys to the alcoholic. Upman cedar-aged Robusto Cameroons to smokers. And the Mesmers to the Arcanist. Anything mystical. When they sit there and point at you with an iron stick, you'll pass out. When they put an iron ring around your neck, you'll feel burnt. You must be familiar with all these freaky tricks, because you are surrounded by freaky tricksters. Like that little girl who protects others with her glass-dipping pen, or that floating apple dancing in the air. The Mesmers know how to suffocate the flames of consciousness. They help you free-fall internally to the bottom of the abyss, as you are now. It's really hard finding an Arcanist who can freely master such skill. As you know, scarcity causes tragedy. That was the start of her nightmare. When the child labor law was turned into a piece of wrinkled paper to wrap the sandwich. The young daughter of the Mesmer family was led to a room when she was twelve. Before she stepped in, she had sensed the messy magnetic field on the other side of the door, thanks to her acute perception. Compared to humans, Arcanists are much more emotionally vulnerable. It won't take much to overwhelm them and force them to regress to animals. 
The Mesmers are merciful and professional. They will never turn away any patient who comes to them for treatment. By then, you should realize the wrapping paper was never protecting the sandwich. But the hand. The mustard from an unknown bottle. The squeezed meatloaf and rusty lettuce leaf. All were crushed and fell out from between the bread. Just like the chaotic noises and the raspy screaming that fill her ears. This filth contaminated the little girl's hands and corrupted the white polyester. Hmm. It is indeed a good time for silence. Now you've noticed those exposed wounds on the machine. Those marks from repeated washing and adjustments. Well, the traumata from childhood is usually hard to forget. Those memories are engraved in our heart and run through our veins. Eventually, they contaminate every single neuron with mucus snot. Since then, every inch of growth is an extension of pain. New bones will be eroded, and the condition can't be cured by cellular renewal. Both you and her are familiar with this. Okay, take your suitcase. Now it's time. Get lost. Prepared. Greetings. Affirmative. Ha! A ravishing rainbow. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. in the tide of blood. Trust me, it won't hurt. agree more. I hope you like a splash of red. Agreed. Affirmative. Close your eyes. It will all be over soon. Have I startled you? Fine. Uh. 
Oh, affirmative. I will pray for you. Sorry. Goodbye, miss. Hmm? I will just take another route. Sonato! Come here! Is my book wall still there? She didn't push it down, right? She didn't. <sighs> she is nice. Unlike the bad potion instructor who turned my books into a puddle of mud. Oh, right. Guess what I found today. Here, give me your hand. Look, the foreteller of the rain, the Hylorborea. I caught it through the school's front gate. I even got stung by the electric fence when I took my hands back. It keeps croaking in my pocket. Look, it's still raining outside. Aren't you aware that you've been given a timeout, Miss Burton? Huh? I don't understand why you always skip classes. You know that we are not supposed to pay too much attention to affairs outside the school. Please, don't bring me these pebbles and frogs anymore. These are... meaningless. We are born to die martyrs. Why? Just because the student handbook says so? That's right. I don't like the handbook. It smells like those stinky socks in the attic. Sonato, aren't you really curious about what is outside the school? You were also in that parade outside the school before. The pebbles, the frogs... The attic with stinky socks. They're just a teeny tiny part of the whole world. I once met a girl who came to our school. Please, please stop. These are very dangerous things. The student handbook is protecting us. It is protecting us from harm and regrets. As the instructors have told us, to live is to lose things around us until the day we lose life itself to death. That's why we should only focus on the supreme missions. Until the day we lose life itself. To death. Now it's coming, my lord. What? Don't forget my heart. Oh. Oh. Failed. Her dramatic segment has been reactivated. Increase the power, stabilize her psych cube. Try the next dream. The artificial sonambulism therapy may not work on her, Mesmer. Hmm? You're here, Madam Z. All patients who have the symptoms of stress disorder need to receive treatments in the rehabilitation center. Her trauma level was assessed as a type 2. I needed to take responsibility for her health. Back in the year when she became the timekeeper, she didn't receive any treatment. I know her well. She has enough power in her to make it through. I'm just following orders, madam. It is the committee's direct order to treat Fairton. If you have anything to say, convince the vice president first. <sighs> she hasn't had any food for days. 
gave her a glucose injection. I have a meeting later, so if you would excuse me. I did expect you would have learned your lesson in such a long time. Timekeeper. No, I'm more used to calling you Fairton. I have changed. Have you? Are you still suffering from those pointless things? in the sky, shining like a record. Oh, welcome. You appear to have come in a hurry. So there must... Your visits are always unexpected.
Battery checked. Are you here to confirm this Apple's expiration date? Good day, my lord. You're too kind, visitor. A crime group? Hm. Just to my liking. Agreed. Affirmative. Our victory comes in the tide of blood. Have I startled you? Extraction of the rainbow. I hope you like a splash of red. Agreed. Oh, I can't agree more. Close your eyes. It will all be over soon. A little surprise. Fine. From me. Charging. Affirmative. Loading. Oh, I can't agree more. Charging. Loading. Charging. The light that illuminates all. Target confirmed. Barrage.
Affirmative. Loading. Charging. A ravishing rainbow. Faraday's miracle. Eliminate target. Battles have little meaning, save for the See me, you can't see me. Hmm, that was certainly a choice. Oh, affirmative. Trust me. It won't hurt. A ravishing rainbow. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Be careful, young man. Shell damaged. Agreed. I hope you like a splash of red. Agreed. Huh. Very well. Close your eyes. It will all be over soon. Have I startled you? Careful, young man. Charging. Hmm. Agreed. Eliminate target. 
A little surprise. That was your oh, familiar choice. I can't agree more. Our blood will burn. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Agreed. Loading. Charging. Our victory comes in a tide of blood. Aim and shoot. Which matters more? Knowledge 